Hello, so today's video is going to be about periodic sequences. So sequences that basically repeat themselves after a certain number of terms. So we've got some examples here. So the first one, one minus one, one minus one, one minus one, is a sequence that's repeating itself. So for every two terms, the sequence repeats. So uh, two terms, two terms, two terms. Um, so the number one repeats after every two terms. Um, and the number minus one repeats after every two terms. It's called a periodic sequence um, and a periodic sequence of order two. But we'll come on to that on the next page. Um, and again, this sequence here is a periodic sequence of order four. Actually, this one here, because, uh, again, it's repeating itself. Uh, this one here is a periodic sequence of order one. So it's repeating itself every term. So it's repeating. Uh, and this one as well, we'll come on to in a minute and we'll see why this iterative recurrence relation is actually a periodic sequence as well. Uh, but let's look at this one here firstly again, the first example. So this is a periodic sequence of order two. Uh, so for every second, for every two terms, the sequence repeats itself. So sequence repeats itself per uh, every two terms. So sequence uh, repeats uh, itself every um, after every two terms. So after every two terms so this is a periodic sequence of order two um similar with this one here this is a peri uh, periodic sequence of order four the the sequence is repeating itself after every four terms so this is an order four periodic sequence uh and then with this one here sorry this is a mistake here this should be a periodic sequence of order one here um this is order four this is order one because the sequence is repeating itself every term so the order of uh, repetition is one and with this one here, um, so let's look at this one. So we've got a recurrence relation, an iterative formula um, with the first term being zero. So we know that A1 using the formula is going to be one minus A0 squared. And that's going to be one minus uh, zero squared. Uh, so that gives us the number one. Now let's try A2. Let's find the next term in the sequence. So our next term in the sequence is going to be uh, A2 equals one minus a one squared, which is one minus uh, one squared, which is just literally the number zero. Uh, so then basically we're going to repeat ourselves because a three is going to be one minus a two squared. Well, that's just going to be one minus zero squared. Uh, that's going to give you a number one again. And then a four, one minus a three squared. Um, that's going to be one minus one squared, which is zero. So the sequence is repeating itself. So one, zero, so, sorry, we start with zero, don't we? Zero is up there. Uh, we start with zero, one, zero, one, zero, one, and so on and so on. So this is a periodic sequence of order two um, because the sequence repeats itself after every two terms. Um, so, yeah, that's just a brief overview of what periodic sequences are. Um, and, uh, yeah, th these are literary examples of periodic sequences.